The amount of guide movement is related to many factors, but the quantity of movement is not necessarily an indicator of guide performance. The job of the guide is to ensure that the material is properly aligned on the first roller following the guide. A guide does not have to appear to move a great deal to be properly performing its job. Here are two examples of why a guide will move and some indicators of how much movement you will see in each scenario. Example 1. The roll being unwound has a near perfect edge with very little variation in the lateral position of the edge of the material on the roll. However, this near perfect roll is shifted 0.5 inches left on the shaft of the desired alignment on the processing machine. In this scenario, the guide will take on an angle such that the material is shifted right 0.5 inches and then you will see virtually no movement of this guide during the unwind of the roll. Example 2. The roll being unwound has a very irregular edge where the material wanders back and forth on the roll. When the guide adjusts for this roll, you will see the guide actively swing back and forth, correcting for the variations in the edge of the roll. In both cases, the guide is helping to ensure that the material is properly positioned as it leaves the guide. In one case, the guide makes a single positional adjustment and then hardly moves. In the other, the guide needs to constantly adjust position for the wandering edge. The significance of these examples is that the guide is performing its job, regardless of how much it appears to be moving. Contact Fife for more complete information about web guiding and output material quality.